It's it. You know what? I'm not the least bit surprised. He always does that. <laughs> That's unbelievable, dude. Oh my gosh. I'm not the least bit surprised he'd be the one to find it. Have you seen any of his videos? He's <laughs> always, he always does this. <laughs> I just got, like, literally, I know it sounds weird, but I just got into, like, starting to watch YouTube videos. And this is the kind of stuff I recently started watching. I haven't made it to your guys' oh channel yet, so. That's neat looking. Finding everything but the RC car. Yeah, I'll pull up. I the thought video. it was more straight out. Yeah, if I was it guess, looks like I it went and it. veered off. We got a magnet on a string, and we're hoping it's powerful enough to pull that RC car up out of the bottom of the pond over there. So we're gonna see yeah, how it goes. Well, if we catch it, then we'll swim down. Uh, I, I ain't even worried about the coldness, but this pond stinks worse than almost every pond I've been in. It, it was just so I dark, my... couldn't, I couldn't even, like yeah. looking up, I couldn't see the surface. So oh, I was yeah. like, I don't even know. So that was Jared from Vlog Creations, a YouTube channel that actually came out here with their RC car. And if you haven't seen Vlog Creations, you guys know they do some amazing pranks on YouTube. They lost their RC car out in this lake and there's a video of that. I'm gonna throw up a clip now. So after they lost their RC car, they were panicking. They brought the magnets out. They brought scuba gear out and they were not able to find it. So Adam, Jeremy and I are here today to hopefully find this RC car and put an end to this mystery. It's been a long time since they lost it and I know they're gonna be super happy to get it back because they're gonna be able to repair it and hopefully we find this thing today. Well hopefully we can find it for you man. Dude. I'm really hoping. Please. <laughs> you ready to do this man? I'm ready dude. I'm excited. I'm, I'm excited to get in this water and cool off because I'm sweating right now. Yeah. Hey, I found a fishing pole. What? <laughs> yeah man. <laughs> Dude, that was pretty nice. Dang, still works. Still works. Was that really yours? No. Oh, it's yours now. We don't want it. No, yeah. Yeah, somebody just dropped that. So Britton's heading the right direction. He has made a hard right and is now lost. That was me. <laughs> I had I had my like weak dive light and they went just. Hey, uh, you going the wrong way. bit surprised he always does that <laughs> that's unbelievable dude oh my gosh I'm not the least bit surprised he'd be the one to find it have you seen any of his videos he's always he always does this <laughs> I just got, like literally I know it sounds weird but I just got into like starting to watch YouTube videos and this is the kind of stuff I recently started watching I haven't made it to your guys oh yet, so. that's neat looking wow it's like the magazine goes on the side and stuff oh my god wow that is so cool our production manager breathes like that you do, but without a mask on. <laughs> <laughs> is it a, is it a, yeah. Don't touch it, Jerry. <laughs> I ain't going back. I ain't going back. <laughs> We're here for our RC car, guys. Quit screwing Yeah, quit messing around with the guns, jeez. Finding everything but the RC car. That is nuts. This That's is insane. So yeah. yeah, my mind is blown right now. You guys are awesome. Just pops up with a gun. <laughs> hey, dude. I found something else. Gun. <laughs> oh, is it beans? It's a can of beans. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited. I think we get one can of beans. I'm gonna go down and come back up like right after we get in the water. All these beans. <laughs> Do it. Do you think? Do you think? <laughs> 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 
But I'm, I'm gonna like not say anything, and then right after we like go in for like a couple minutes, pop up. So they were super nice, man. Got the beans, man. I got the beans. <laughs> yes! Yeah. Wait, are these potential murder weapons too? <laughs> oh. Daddy. <laughs> you guys are too good. <laughs> no way. That is crazy. Just the, this like seeing beans <laughs> like triggers me to vomit. <laughs> Just the amount of beans that have been in our channel and like when they get hot. You think that's a good spot? Probably, yeah. Probably down there and then go straight forward into your left a little bit. I really didn't expect him to find a gun. This didn't really look like a gun type of neighborhood, you know? It's a very nice, uppity little neighborhood. And I'm like, oh, oh that's water. water. <laughs> <laughs> that's such a good idea. I was like, ah, that's awesome. <laughs> that, that is pretty awesome. I was like, I already want to throw up just by looking at the game. Yeah, I'm sure it floated a little bit. It's so. 30 feet to I'm curious. I do. I'm hoping he has the car, but it'll be funny if he comes up with another gun. <laughs> it's like, this is not what we came here for. <laughs> Still cool though. Are you drowning? Oh! oh! Nice, dude. <laughs> That's so cool. I said I'd go in and you got it. <laughs> yes. Stripping down. <laughs> man of my word. <laughs> oh, this like stinks. Yes, dude. That was intense, dude. I couldn't see anything. I was just literally feeling around when I came across that. That is awesome, man. Dude, that thing's a lot bigger than I thought it was. This is it. That's a this nice one. Heavy. It's like really heavy. <laughs> I got it, Britton. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I never doubted us for a second, man. <laughs> I can't believe I got that thing, man. That's awesome, dude. I was Success. getting nervous. I was like, <laughs> I was like, we gotta find this thing, man. I know. We knew it was out here. It was just a matter of. Oh, it was just feeling around. Yeah. But you couldn't see anything down there. Yeah. Well, because when you feel, you just murk it up all the time and. Yeah, I found a big metal barrel. Is that what you said? Yeah, yeah. yeah There's something in it. That was a little creepy, man. That was a little weird. <laughs> we gonna call the police on that gun? Hmm. Uh, let's double check. I'm curious about that barrel. Yeah, that's what I'm over. saying. <laughs> oh yeah, man. <laughs> we found it. This is it. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, dude. This is awesome. These dude. are our saviors, right here of this RC Mission car. success, man. We did it. <laughs> Look at that. That's incredible. Clearly, here, feel how heavy this is? Yeah, dude. That thing's not meant to flow. Oh, no. no. <laughs> that thing is yeah, going dude. into the water. Yeah, this thing is... Okay, oh, that's... I'm so happy for you, man. I'm happy for you guys. <laughs> you found a gun and a car. I know. Yeah, dude, yeah. What about that gun, too? So, we're about to call the police on this gun that I was able to find. And it does have some serial numbers on it. So, I think they could potentially, you know, either tell if it's stolen or if it was used in a crime. So, we're going to go ahead and get it and call the police. Just wanted to stress that this is not an emergency, but we're over at the... What? Anderson West. But, West, the West Benderson boat ramp. The West Benderson boat ramp, and I was doing some scuba diving over by the boat ramp, and I found uh, some sort of gun. It looks like it has some serial numbers on it. Yes, yes, ma'am. We were looking for an RC car originally, and I happened to come across it. So. Okay. <laughs> right. And did it look? It looked pretty intact with serial numbers. Oh yeah. I've got this set up to dispatch. We're gonna get somebody over there. And the boat ramp, is that like in the middle of that pond? Uh, no, not the middle one. It's the one on the uh, east side of the lake. You'll see all that. So we the have like little a... pond, the one that's on the east side. Okay. Okay. All right, I'm familiar with that. Dude, it, it was like sticking with the... Um... I was like, I don't know, it was like somebody handwritten scratch. There's a six right there printed on it. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely... There's six more guns. It's old, yeah, probably. <laughs> it's old. 
Where that? Where was I when I came up? Like I, way out there. Far out. I don't think. realistically only throw a gun so far. Yeah. yeah. CJ. Hey, good to meet you. Nice to meet you, buddy. We uh, we were diving over here. We were looking for an RC car originally, and I pulled up a gun. Okay. And so I just wanted to give it to you guys. Yeah, no Thought problem. it would be the best. Hey, you know who Vlog Creations is? Ross. Ross? Yeah. <laughs> who doesn't? Whatever. How did it wind up in the pond? I, well, allegedly, what happened? I, 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 I had a crazy night. I woke up and it was in there. Gotcha. So this is what you're here for. Really? Nice Car, was stolen. <laughs> Car was stolen. Car was stolen. No, we didn't want to do the insurance rounds. Looks like it was taken apart. I don't know. Looks like the chamber's clear. It's got enough crap in it though. There we go. Yeah. There you go. Should be compared to what we usually find. That's in really good shape. It is in really good shape. It's still functional and everything. Yeah. Oh. Alright, let me see if I can. Yeah, people find guns. A lot. Around here. Um, this is the first one I've ever yeah. been to. Really? Yeah. And uh, it was funny when they sent me the call. I was like, man, <laughs> I've seen so many cops show up for that call, like watching all the. YouTube oh, yeah. I'm like, I'm finally getting the call that day. Yeah. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna make sure to not go there and like be all pissed off, like, oh, you made this work. <laughs> yeah. We were just talking about. It. Yeah, I mean, because if it's stolen or using you know, a crime, whatever, it'd be cool to. Yeah, are you able to like run the numbers? I'm gonna try and see. That'd out. be amazing. That'd be awesome. Yeah. How amazing. amazing. They find out it's stolen. stolen guy, That'd yeah. be crazy, dude. How crazy? So crazy. Oh, I, I mean, the gun's crazy. cool and all, but I kind of think there's only two cars. The RC cars. Find of the day right here. <laughs> find of the day. Oh, Let's go look at this guy clean this thing off. I mean, I'll tell you, I think you guys haven't been in trouble in a while, right? Yeah. <laughs> I think the last one was what, like the impersonating a police officer at Walmart? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, we had, I mean, the last one in our county that I know of. Allegedly. Come over to the house for something, but it, it was taken care of. I can't say what it is, because it hasn't been Subscribe, like, yeah, so share, follow subscribe. our channel. Yeah. Frank John 41089. Unknown what the major model is at this point. Because it's about the second possibility. It may be an altered submachine gun. They don't have any record on the serial number, so um, if they're not able to tie it to any kind of crime or evidence or stolen or anything like that, yeah, you guys would be the ones that come back. Tell you what, yeah. yeah. If they if they let you get it back, you can have it. Yeah. Can you put it in my name? Yeah. Is that a thing? Yeah, I just what I'll do is I'll get all your info as a complainer. <laughs> there is some uh, potential evidence firearms that we're looking for for different cases okay um so even though it's not necessarily reported as stolen they don't know if it was used in any kind of a crime, crime. either in our our jurisdiction or somewhere else of course so um that was one of the forensics members and they're like yeah we have to do like a full workup on it and try and see if we can match it to anything um so with that apparently <clears throat> it remaining in water helps preserve the firearm so it doesn't like corrode and things like that so they want it turned into them like submerged in that water. Oh, okay yeah but i don't have any way to do that so yeah. they're getting in touch with the manager or we've uh, had that before they've done that before from forensics yeah. and then yeah. they may potentially bring out a bucket and okay we'll go through and, and do that process so okay If you guys want to get some of this amazing merch, you can go to uh, blogcreations.com. Hey! So, if you're not familiar, uh, there's like a bunch of YouTubers that assist law enforcement. Well, not necessarily assist law enforcement, but in, in the end, they wind up doing it by doing a lot of diving. And they find like cold case missing persons and car, stolen cars and different things like that. So, essentially, these guys are involved in that group. Okay. Um, from two different YouTube channels, and they came to assist Vlog Creations, that's a local YouTube channel, in locating an RC car in the lake. And in doing so, he found a firearm. Yes. So. Hi. Um, right, it's a semi-automatic is what you Yeah, saying. it looks like it 
is based off Google's. It looks like it may be a submachine gun. There's a few different companies that make a very similar looking one. Okay. So I don't see anything on it because it's covered in dirt and I only, where I saw some numbers, I wiped it to try and get the numbers off, but otherwise I didn't want to like remove the dirt and potentially disrupt anything. Yeah. Clear and safe now, and there was no ammunition in it at all. <laughs> we take a hard turn. You just slam on the brakes. I think it's like a. <laughs> All right, everybody, that is going to wrap up another video of Depths of History. We made it out to Sarasota, Florida, and with the help of the sheriff, we were able to determine that this gun is some sort of submachine gun. It appears that way based off of the Google that you guys pulled up real quick. Um, I didn't see anything like designating what type of brand it was or anything like that, but we were able to potentially get a serial number off it, and it didn't come back as being reported stolen at this point so gotcha there will be some more investigation will be put in our property and, and they'll determine if it's re related to any other type of crime at this point but uh at this point it doesn't seem that there's anything obvious that pointing it towards a crime awesome sweet so it's going to take i think 30 days for it to be processed and then potentially jared can come back to the sheriff's <laughs> office claim the gun that i found and you're going to have a really cool souvenir for like your wall or something yeah, like yeah. that a gun so that's and, gonna an be pretty RC cool. car. and we found jared's rc car so if you would like to check out vlog creations i'll have them linked in the description below also check out adam brown adventures exploring with nug and we will see you guys on the next adventure Thank you.